What's up everybody? Welcome to today's video. It's going to be a review on my new ZNZ Customs foot pegs rear sets. They're about 225 bucks. Uh, but I've already crashed and broken two sets and these are super sturdy. Uh, so, give me a new level of confidence. I don't have to worry about crashing, trying to scrape and breaking something. To focus more on what I'm doing. Uh, the guy says they take about a month to come in, but it just kind of depends on what he's working on at the time. He does like batches where he makes them, so he'll make cages at one time and then rear sets and then sliders or whatever, but uh, I got mine in like three weeks and they came out really good. I was really happy with them. I w you can get different widths on the foot pegs, make them wider. Uh, I may, these work on my foot really well. They won't get in the way if I wanna go try to like lean over real far or something, but the wider ones would have fit my foot a little better. I mean, it's just enough to get my foot on there. But these are not the widest ones. You can go wider. Um, I would definitely recommend y'all getting some of these if you've already crashed once i mean what you spend 30 bucks to get the rear set assembly and that's if you don't break your peg which is like another 10 bucks and everything so yeah i mean what you crash four i don't know if you crash a bunch you're gonna you're gonna pay for them and then you just don't even have to worry about it like i can crash my ride's not over because that's happened but they look super good. And they're also gonna keep it, like if I if I was to crash, none of my bike is gonna touch the ground now. I'll just lay it over and show y'all. So like, look at that. Nothing touches. Crash all day. All day. Now all I need is some axle sliders for the front. If anybody wants to hook me up with some of those. Uh, but, yeah, I'll put the link in the description on where to get them. I'm not being sponsored or anything. I just think they're a good product. Keep you from having to keep buying parts. Uh, they're working great so far. This is a first ride. I got way more confidence on, on wheelies. I might even try to scrape later. But... I hope that was helpful for somebody looking to get these. I mean, you need to kind of look at them like that. Yeah, I look good. Definitely worth it. Uh, if y'all enjoyed that, uh, I'm gonna do some more review videos for other parts like KLX 110 handlebars. I got some risers, got an exhaust. I did an airbox mod. Uh, we're gonna do a shifter lever soon because that's bent and all in my way. But, yeah, uh, let's move on and just do some wheelies. Yeah. All right, there's the trail. Uh oh, look at this, what do we got here? Oh, uh, this is like a boat camp. That, nope. Nope, we're out of there. Oh, it's like homeless, little homeless city. Oh, cross the bridge.
speeding it up and slowing it down. Those people enjoyed it. Uh, see, that right there, that made riding around today worth it. I met one guy excited like that, all pumped up. I'm happy with these foot bags. They're, uh, they're, they're starting to feel pretty good. Just like anything, you change anything on a bike, it takes, takes a little bit of riding to get used to it.